Hey, what are you doing? Going to my room, so? Can you get me a cup of water? I'm so thirsty. Oh, do you have legs? Hey, I'm just asking for help. Because the kitchen is closer to your room. If you're going in that direction anyway, it's okay to help me a little. You also study in the same school as me. Tomorrow you can take the exam for me. What the? That's the different thing. It's all the same. And don't you see that? There's a water bottle right in front of you. So why do you still want to ask me? I don't like drinking orange juice. I like drinking water. And I also want to eat a little more snack. So can you? Go take it by yourself, you lazy. What's wrong with her? I just ask for a little help. In Roblox game. <laughs> What's again? My stepsis. Oh, I get it. You already know too much about her without waiting for me to explain. So how do you plan to solve this? I mean it's not good if you're together and you're uncomfortable like this. I don't know either. Because now we still live under the same roof. It's hard to have some privacy. If you hate her that much, just tell her clearly. That she should stop invading your personal affairs. Don't get me wrong. I don't hate her. No matter what, she is still my sister. Stepsister. Almost the same. You know what? Sometimes being nice to someone doesn't make them a better person. Huh? Do you remember your first boyfriend? You mean Sam? Exactly. Flashback. Hey, Layla, here you are. Oh, hey, Sam. What's up? Do you want to play something with me? Our exam is over anyway. Yeah, sure. Why not? Cool. So what do you want to play? I'll play anything with you. Anything, really? Really. Then let's play some horror games. Oh my god, I love horror games. Oh, um, really? Yeah, why are you asking? Because, um, because. Just tell me that you don't want to play it. No, I didn't mean that. I really love you and want to play with you, but I can't play horror game. It's too scary. <sighs> Fine, I can see that. Then I'll play it first. Can you wait? What? You leave me alone. Sam, you kept promising me that you would play horror games with me after I played with you. But in the end, a promise is just a promise. You don't do it. I've been waiting for you for three weeks. If you're afraid, don't accept my promise in the first place. Why would you do that? I'm just afraid that you will hate me because of this. But if you lied to me, this is not better. Do you understand it? Hey everybody, what's up? Can I play with you guys? Olivia, what are you doing? I mean, why are you here? You should go to bed. If you are not going to sleep, then why I must do that? Huh, who is she? Well, she's my sister. My stepsister actually. Oh cool, hello there. My name is Sam, I'm Layla's boyfriend. Nice to meet you Sam. I'm Olivia. So what happened? Are you guys fighting? No. That is not your business. Just go to bed and mind it your own business. I just want to play with you. What is wrong? Hey, don't be rude to her. I think she just want to play with us. I mean, I don't mind when she joins us. But she have a school tomorrow. So she need to go to sleep early. We can play because our exam is over. And she is not. Oh, don't worry about me. I already done studying. Now I can play with you guys. Can you play alone? Because we are talking, and you interrupted us. Layla, come on. Just let her join. You still play horror game anyway. And I have to wait. So that's that mean you want to play with my stepsister? I don't think that is a bad idea. What? You played horror game? Is that game too violent? I mean lovers must not playing it with each other. That's not romantic at all. Oh my god, you and I have the same thought. I really appreciate that. I'm just saying the truth. What's wrong with me if I want to play horror game? That's my hobby anyway. If you guys can't play it then fine. I will playing it alone. Luckily, she didn't force me to join her. Being her boyfriend is really tired, right? I don't want to admit this, but yeah. Sometimes she is really annoying. And I can't help that. But what do I do now? She is still my girlfriend anyway. What about this? I have a really nice idea. And I think that will help you get out of this situation. Oh my really, tell me. You can be my boyfriend. What they? Don't be shocked, just listen to me first. If you became my boyfriend, I will listen to you everything. I mean, I won't force you do something you don't want to do. And you can play anything you want. Talk with everyone, I don't care. I don't control you like her. Are you serious? She's your sister. Stepsister. Okay, okay, but are you sure? 
If I'm not then why am I talking to you like this? Trust me, I just want the best for you. Stay here and looking at you guys. I really want to help you. She is really mean sometimes as you can see. Well, I guess you are right. She is nice, but I guess I will change my mind after this. I can love someone to control me. Then just talk to her that you love me at the first sight. Problem solved. Okay. And flashback. And that's how she stole your first boyfriend. I know, I know. I uh, must admit that I really mad at that time. But that guy is not good to her anyway. He said Olivia is too clingy and then want to get back with me. Ha, huh, is he dreaming? You will never do that. Exactly. But everything is in the past now. And now we try to live in peace with each other. Even though sometimes she really annoying. If you say so then I don't have anything else. Yeah, thank you for talking to me like this. I feel so much better. You're welcome, bestie. Sometime later. Hey sis, can I talk to you? What do you want? Can you just be nice with me for a second? I just want a peaceful talk. Okay then, go ahead. I'm still being nice with you. Okay so, um, can I join your group chat? Why do you want that? Don't you have any friends? Yeah, that is a reason why I ask you about this. I don't want to bother you, but I really don't have anyone else. All my friends are leaving, and I don't know why. Maybe it's because your personality. Oops, Oops I, can't I can't say, say that. that. That's, That's too, too mean. mean. Maybe it's because you guys doesn't suit each other. So no need to be sad. You'll find some friends someday. Thank you, I get it. But can I join you? Let me think about it. I'll tell you when I'm done thinking. Thank you so much, sis. You are so kind. I will waiting for you. Okay, Olivia has been less noisy lately. I guess it's fine to let her join us sometime. Hey guys. Hi bestie. Yo babe, it's so good to see you. I love you Jeff. Love you too, babe. Guys, I'm still fa. Oops, I'm so sorry girl. I didn't mean it. Sorry Rose, huh? Apologies accepted. Hey you guys, wanna play truth or dare? Great idea. Nice, let's play. Oh, let's me add my stepsister. The more players, the merrier. Oh, are you sure about it? Yeah, it's okay. She had changed. Well, I hope so. What are you guys talking about? No, nothing much. Just some random girl stories. Oh, okay. So can I add her now? Okay. okay. Layla at Olivia in the group chat. Hi everyone, I'm Olivia. Okay, this is my stepsister. And sis, they are my friends. Rose and my boyfriend, Jeff. You have a boyfriend? Yeah, what's wrong? No, nothing much. I'm just surprised that someone like you also has a boyfriend. Excuse me? I'm just kidding. Don't take it too serious. I mean my sister is amazing. How could C don't have a boyfriend? Egg, okay, okay. Wow, your stepsister looks so rich. Same thought, because I don't know why she has that much Robux. Even though she lives under the same roof as Layla. That's because I asked my mother for money. And she doesn't. So that's why I'm richer than her. Shh, I can see that. Your mama's girl. At least I have a lot of Robux. Unlike someone. Huh? What do you mean? Nothing, let's play, everyone. Uh, okay. So let me go first. Rose, truth or dare? Truth? Okay. So Rose, who is the person you have a crush on? What? It's too hard, girl. But you still have to tell the truth. Yeah, that's the rules. Fine, it's Jason. Jason, who's Jason, I wonder. Ah, Jason, your neighbor? A cousin. Yeah, you're right, it's him. He, I got a hot new. Hey, stop it, don't playing with me. You really, Jason? He's so rude, and he's not that handsome. But it's okay, he's your type then. No, he's not rude. He is the kindest person I have ever met. You're the one who being rude to him. Hey, I'm just talk about my feelings about him. So, can you just shut up? Because he's my crush, not yours. Hey now guys, come down. And Olivia, you can't talk like that. Sh whatever. Chill girls. Okay, so I'm next. Layla, truth or dare? Hum, dare. Wow, you're so brave, Layla. Okay, I dare you to send us your real face. That dare is too easy. But I still don't know anything about her face, so this is really good. Of course, why not? Wow, you so cute, babe. Damn girl, you're so beautiful. Thank guys. Duh. Okay, let's me ask you Olivia. Go on, baby boy. Wah. Um, can you don't call me like that? I already have someone. 
Oh, relax, I'm just kidding. Truth or dare Olivia? Truth. Okay, do you have a boyfriend? Jeff, what the fuck? Chill babe, I just asked her a simple question. Oh, I love that question. I don't have any boyfriend. Gray, ah, uh, I mean okay. Jeff, I'm so sorry. And it's my turn. Jeff, truth or dare? Dare, of course. You choose dare too. Yes, I want to be like you. Okay. So Jeff, I dare you to kiss me. What the hell, Olivia? What the heck, you go too far. Chill girl, it's just a game. Just a game? What do you mean? It's mean you are going to kiss her. Oh, come on, babe. It's just a kiss. Just a kiss? Okay, then kiss her. And we're broke up. Layla, why are you so mean? She's your stepsister. Don't be so selfish with your stepsister. What? Then break up with me. Layla. Oops, wrong place. Damn, you're so hot. I knew it. Jeff, Olivia. Okay. I'll break up with you, Layla. Olivia is better than you. You're right, boy. I'm better than her. Shut up, Olivia. You can't yell at her like that, Layla. Oh, thanks, babe. Wanna be my boyfriend? What the fuck? Yes, I'll be your boyfriend. So let's kick her out the group. No, you can't do this to me, Jeff. I'm your girlfriend. Not anymore. Jeff kick Layla out of the group chat. What the, what are you doing, Jeff? She's so annoying. So I kicking her out. You. Damn you, Olivia. You make my bestie sad. You too, son of bitch, Jeff. Don't let me see you two again. So just only me and you here. Wanna go hang out this weekend? I'll take you to the mall. Great idea. I'd love to go to shopping. When are you come? Right now, babe. Oh my gosh, really? Cool. You're awesome boyfriend I've ever have. Of course I am. Meanwhile. Don't be sad, Layla. I'm still here with you. Yeah, thanks. I was so stupid to think she would change. See, I told you. A normal person doesn't change that quickly. Don't worry, Rose. I must say thanks to Olivia. What? Why? She just helping me take out the trash and helped me realize the real him. That trap boy must get out of my life. You're right, girl. I was worried that you would be upset because of that bastard. But after hearing you say that, I feel more secure. Yep, don't worry. I'm still fine, just a little shocked. Well, I can see that. Remember, I always here for you. Ah, uh, thanks, girl. Two hours later. Thank you for buying all the dresses that I like. I love you so, so much. It's just a small thing. Now do you want to go to the cinema? I'll buy popcorn and drinks. Oh, you're so sweet, honey. Of course, I'll go with you. It's just for you, babe. Five hours later, in the late of the night. What happened, mom? Why are you staying so late? You must go to bed now. I can sleep right now. Layla, have you seen Olivia anywhere? No, I haven't. But wait, that means she is not home. You are right. So weird, it's too late. Why hasn't she come back yet? Have you tried calling her? Yes, I have, but she doesn't answer the phone. Today, I saw her out of the house in the afternoon, but I don't know where she went. Um, I'm so nervous. Calm down, stepmom. Let me try asking everyone I may know. So please help me, thank you. It's okay, stepmom. Oh, hi, Tim. It's me, Layla. I'm her stepsister. Hi, what's up? Do you know where is Olivia? Ha, ah, she didn't come home. It's too late. Yeah, I know. That's the reason why I need to calling to you. I heard that she go out with her new boyfriend. She said that with me. Do you know where they went? Wait me a second. Oh, she said she will go to the mall with her boyfriend. And then the cinema. That's it. Okay, thank you. I got it. Mom, Tim said that Olivia go to the mall with her boyfriend. And then the cinema. But if they are going to the cinema, they must leave earlier. Because the mall is closed at this hour. I don't know. Mom, maybe we must call the cops. I'm worried that something happened. I'll call the cops now. Meanwhile. Where are we going, babe? This is not the way home. Yes, you're right. You must come to my house, babe. I have so much thing to do with you, and I think you will love it. What? I don't want. Let me out. I want to go home. You're not going anywhere. What do you want, Jeff? Wait, no, help. Hush it up, bitch. You're so annoying. I'm planning to kidnap your big sister, but you are so stupid to make it easier for me to act. Huh? They will pay a very high price for you. What the hell? Police? Damn it. I gotta go. Stay right where you are. Stop right now. 
Then the police stopped his car and saved Olivia. Remember not to go with strangers, okay? Yes, I remember. Thank you, sir. Don't thanks me, thanks your sister. Now my work is done. We have to go. Thank you to helping my daughter. You're welcome. So? I'm so sorry, sis. Yeah. Yeah, keep stealing my boyfriend and this is what you get. Are you happy now? But all of your boyfriends, none of them is good people. Hey, watch your mouth. I'm just saying the truth. If I know you can talk like this, I will not tell mom to call the police. You still so stubborn. I'm sorry. I already know my mistake. Please forgive me. I'm wrong. I'm glad you know that. See, sister, karma is real. I know. I'll never do that again. Good. I hope so. Now go inside and say sorry to mom. She's so nervous because of you. Okay, I got it. Remember never trust someone you just met. The end. Select fruits or animals. Oh, what is this? Select fruits or animals? Maybe it gives me a power. I'll pick animals. Animal selected. Yeah, it's power. I hope I get something good. Um, what's infinity? I hope I find out soon. Whatever, I'll go see what my friends got. Hey rats. Hi Discharge. Sup idiots. What powers did y'all get? I got fire powers. Oh cool. I can talk to animals and control them. Woof woof rough bark bark. Stop barking, Skylar. Okay. Oh clever dog. Hum. You know, Thomas, sometimes I wish you were an animal. Why? Then maybe I could use my power to control that fiery mouth of yours. Because you're like a sassy, mischievous skunk. <laughs> Umeo Skylar. Stop! How about you, Brooklyn? I don't know. What? what? Are you kidding me? So what did you pick? Um, I picked animals, but it's infinity. Infinity? Any hints about your power? None, not a clue. I wish it would just show itself already. Don't worry. It'll come to you. Anyways, your power is awesome, Skylar. I've never heard of animal powers before. Oh, what the hell is that? What is it? Guys, I think I found out what my power is I didn't know had it meant before. Let me test it, nature powers. Oh my god, guys, my power is that every power I say, I get. It probably only lasts for like 10 minutes, though. Oh my god, what? Seriously? Girl, you're so look at that power is so op. I'm really- Yay. Oh, come on, Brooklyn. You're such a liar. What do you mean? You're just making up this power thing to fool us. Into thinking you've got the coolest powers ever. What? No, I swear it's true. I'm not making it up. I just discovered it accidentally. Lol. Fine, don't believe me. I'll show you. Okay, Brooklyn. So, like, if you said you could fly. You'd be soaring through the sky right now. Exactly, watch this. I have the power to fly. Wow. Whoa, that's incredible. So, you can have any power you want just by saying it. This is nuts. Oh my god, I'm jealous you're literally a god. Ha! Ah. Guys, let's play Adopt Me. I have a surprise for you since it's your birthday, Brooklyn. Okay, join me. They join Adopt Me. Okay, Brooklyn, trade me. Okay. By the way, Skiller, you really don't have to give me anything. Your presence is more than enough. Yeah, I know I don't have two, but I want two. Oh my god, Skiller. This is my DP, thank you so much. Bro, I want something. Yeah, well, it isn't your birthday, Thomas. Buck. Happy birthday, Bistie. Oh, love you, Skylar. They play in three hours. It's so funny, huh? No. Oh, guys, my little sister wants to join our group chat. Can I add her? Sure. Yeah, as long as she isn't as annoying as you two. Oh, shut up already, Thomas. Oh, mayo. Yay for real man. Hi, guys. My, my name is Penelope. I'm Brooklyn's sis. Pineapple. No, it's Penelope. Oh, my bad. Pineapple. Penelope, close enough. Right. Thomas, come on. Be nice, it's Penelope. Okay, okay, haha. Hey, Penelope. What's your best pet in Adopt Me? It is a frost dragon. Oh my god. She's young and probably stupid. 
I can easily scam this brat. Oh my god, Brooklyn, you little sis is so cute. Yay ha. Thank you. Here, take this pet shadow dragon. Wow, it looks so cool. What are these were? Penelope, it's like one of the rares. It's the most unrare pet in the game. Can I have it for my Frost Fury? Thomas, what the heck? We're right here we can see that you're trying to scam my little sis. Penelope don't trust him. We're kicking you, Thomas. Attention all Robloxians. Anyone under the age of 18 with a power will be attending a school for powers. Oh my god, haha, I forgot we just got powers. I will hurt you all with my fire if you don't give me your best pets. Mind control? <laughs> ha ha Wow, what a jerk. We were friends for two years and he did that. Wait, so what is my shadow dragon actually were? Oh, it's like one of rarest pet in the game. Guys, oh my god, I almost forgot we're going to hero school now. Oh yeah, by the way, what did you get Penelope? Oh, I can just kind of float things any direction I want. It's kind of useless. I think that's awesome. Thank you. Oh my god, our letters for what role we got in the hero school are here. I hope we all get hero and not villain or sidekick. Oh, oh my god. god. Oh my god, I got hero. Oh my god, same. Oh, I got sidekick. I'm so sorry, Penelope. Actually, sometimes if Psydecix become powerful enough, they are boosted up to hero. Work hard, Penelope. Shoot, guys, we're going to be late. Let's go. I will go to sidekick classes, I guess. Okay, bye, Penelope. Bye. We should go to class now. Yay. They get there. Hello, little rat children. I'm Miss Aria. Oh. And welcome to Hero Classes at the Power School. Okay, please introduce yourself and your powers. Okay, me first. My name is Adeline and my power is Mind Control. Ooh. Ooh. My name is Lucky and my power is Unnatural Good Luck. <laughs> oh my god, hey, a $100 on my desk. Wow! Hmm. Wonderful, Samvana. Okay. My name is Skiller and I have the animal powers. My name is Brooklyn and I have the power infinity. Every power I say, I get for about one minute. Whoa, that's one of the god powers. Okay, so everyone find a partner. Also, you can't say no to anyone. And then say yes to someone else, that's rude. Skyler, let's be part. Skiller wanna be partners with me? Oh, okay. Hey, Brookhaven, and... Wait, I'm Brooklyn. Oops, sorry. Let's be partners. Okay. Alright, so we have fake Jillian holograms and you. And your teammate are going to figure out how to defeat it together as a team. Don't you mean villain? Don't correct me, it's rude. Whatever. Okay, the villains are spawning. <laughs> One hour later. Baha, those were so easy to kill. Okay, class is dismissed. Oh my god, Adeline, your power is so cool. You should be a lead hero. Huh, I know. You guys did great at the villain test. Yeah, we know. Shut up and don't interrupt me, brat. What? Skiller, aren't you gonna say something? Just don't interrupt her. What? I didn't even. Oh my god, shut up already. But nobody wants you here. Shut the hell up, you stupid brat. Oh my god, Brooklyn, I didn't know you were this kind of person. I don't think we should be friends anymore. What? Let's go, Skylar. Oh my god, Lucky. She just met Adeline two hours ago, and suddenly it's like I don't exist. My bestie just dumped me for Adeline. Um, I'm sorry. Hello, miss. Here is a free iPhone 15. Oh wow, thanks. Goodbye, miss. What the hell was that? Oh, just my everyday luck. Right, I forgot about your power. Okay, so to continue that conversation, Adeline was my childhood best friend, and she always shared jealousy issues. And she loved just people who she was jealous of lives. And she manipulates people not giving her anything she wants, and adoring her and constantly complimenting her. 
She is like seven minions right now. And they would do anything for her. Oh, that means class. Okay, I will be the four of you's group instructor for the class. The person standing next to you is a person from the villain school who you are going to be battling. Wait, Thomas. Oh my god, Brooklyn. Fuck. What is it? This is so damn unfair. Why would you put me with a person so up, you stupid lady? Boy, you can either leave this classroom immediately or face the consequences. Haha, <laughs> like you would do anything to me. Do you know who I am? No, and I don't care. I'm Mr. and Mrs. Grayson's kid. What? The lead villains? Oh my god, I'm so so sorry. Please don't tell them. I won't as long as give me good grades and suspend Brooklyn. What? I can't do that. She didn't do anything. All right, I suppose I can tell them. Wait, no. I'm sorry, Brooklyn. Okay, miss. Wait for me, Brooklyn. Haha, <laughs> bye losers. One hour later, in the group chat. Brooklyn, let's go talk to your best friend. Okay. Oh my god. Hey, Brooklyn. Why did you leave our table earlier? What? Because you and Adeline were being rude. How? I didn't talk like the whole time other than when I complimented Adeline. And then I think I dozed off. Because I don't remember and after that. Yeah, yeah, sure. Make up any excuse you want. But now I know you're toxic. Lying fake friend. Bye, I don't want to look at you right now. Wait, what's going on? Oh no, I think I understand. What? I swear I wasn't rude to her. Yeah, but Adeline has mind control powers. The person she mind controls forgets everything that happened in that moment. What? You're saying Adeline mind controlled me and was rude Brooklyn through me. Yes, she is most likely jealous of Amra because of her god power. Well, I can't believe this. I never thought about how it would be dangerous to be friends with someone who had mind control powers. Can you explain this to Brooklyn for me? She clearly isn't in the mood to talk to me. Okay, I'll try. Thanks a lot. Brooklyn, listen. What's up? I knew Adeline hated me, but she went too far. Yeah. Hey, Skylar, I'm so sorry for not believing you. It's okay, I understand. Phew, that's a relief. I thought I was losing you. You're my best friend, Skylar. You too. I'm so glad everything is back to normal. Yeah, friends forever? Absolutely, Brooklyn, friends forever. A Brooklyn and I are going to grab some lunch. What about Skylar? Wanna join Skylar? Oh, thanks, but I already ate. Oh, well, we'll catch you later then. Sure, have a great lunch, guys. Bye. Okay, bye, guys. Um, well, I've been feeling a bit, I don't know, distant lately. And I can't help but notice Brooklyn and Lucky getting closer. It's probably just my imagination. Skylar. How, oh, Thomas? I need to tell you something that's important. What do you want? <coughs> oh my god, what's wrong with you? Brooklyn told me to be rude and tried to scam her little sis. Or she would make me get expelled from the power school as soon as I got in. And then she still hated me so much. She got me into the villain program instead of hero. Oh, will Skiller believe me? I don't believe him, but I'll pretend I do to get more info. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, Thomas. It's okay, at least he has someone to trust now. I'm gonna go see you later, Thomas. Okay, bye. Brooklyn. Oh my god, Thomas just won't leave us alone. Yeah, by the way, did you confront Adeline? No, I think should just stay away from her. Okay. Oh my god, Thomas is calling me. I got to go. Okay, bye. Hi, Skiller. I bought you chocolate-covered strawberries, your favorite. Oh, you remembered? Of course I did. Thank you so much, Thomas. One week later, Thomas and Skiller become best friends. We graduate into supervillains and superheroes tomorrow. Yeah, I'm so anxious. What if I have to stay in author year? I'm sure you won't. You're really powerful. Ah, oh, thanks, Thomas. 
I'm I'm gonna be right back. Bye bye. Um, guys, I really don't want to do a plan. Thomas and I are really close now. What? Skylar, I hate to put so much pressure on you, but it's either him or us. Then, then I choose him. You have really changed you bit so much pressure on all the time. What? Goodbye, best friend. Oh my god, I can't believe this. <laughs> she was my, my best friend since. Since we were in Sniff Kindergarten. And she, she ditched me for him. I am so sorry, Brooklyn. <sighs> Brooklyn, I hate to say it, but this isn't the first time Skylar has seemed to prioritize someone else over you. It's the second time this has happened. And it's clear that Skiller might not value your friendship as much as you do hers. I just don't understand why she keeps doing this. We've been friends for so long. Sometimes people change and their priorities shift. It's tough to accept, but you deserve friends who value you consistently. Skylar might not see the significance of your friendship in the same way you do. I just never thought it would come to this. It hurts lucky. I know, Brooklyn, and it's okay to feel hurt. But sometimes, it's healthier to distance yourself from those who consistently bring you down. Focus on the friends who appreciate and support you, like me. You're right, Lucky. Thanks for being a true friend. Always, Brooklyn. You deserve the best. Three months later. Okay, please welcome your school's first ever lead hero graduate. Today's a big day, and I'm so proud of all your hard work. Remember, this is just the beginning. Embrace the future and stay true to yourselves. Congrats. Now, it's time to announce the graduates. First up, please welcome Brooklyn. Brooklyn Royal, congratulations. Thanks, Miss Aria. Okay, now all the normal superheroes. Adeline Karenson. Congratula. How rude. My turn. Skylar Bambi. Buck. Mimi. Lucky Banana. Um. 3,000 years later. Okay, now villains. Our first ever lead villain, Thomas Grayson. Yeah. After graduation. Finally. Haha, <laughs> yeah, that was a long school year. No. I mean, finally, I don't have to be your friend anymore. What? Everyone get her. Oh no. Thomas let me go. Haha, <laughs> we don't want any of you heroes loose. But I'll let you go if you tell me all of Brooklyn's weaknesses. The end.